Nine children go to the hospital when their school bus rolls over. Thanks for joining us. I'm Bill Shamrix. I'm Julie Cornell. The crash happened this morning. It was on Highway 2, just east of Palmyra. Investigators say a pickup truck rear-ended the bus, causing it to land on its side. KETV News Watch 7's Andrew Ozaki talks with the Palmyra School Superintendent, who's grateful everybody will survive. A school bus carrying nine children to Bennett ends up on its side. State Patrol investigators say the bus driver was westbound on Highway 2 near Palmyra this morning and turned into a driveway when a pickup hit the bus from behind. Well, anytime you get a phone call where uh, kids are uh, reportedly uh, involved in some type of an accident, your heart drops. Uh, because that's the worst nightmare for anybody. District OR1 Superintendent Mike Hart and other school officials rushed to the scene. Thankfully, it could have been a, uh, could have been a lot worse, but there were no life-threatening injuries. The children are ages 5 to 14. The school contacted their parents immediately. Witnesses tell us the bus driver made sure all of the children were accounted for, even though she was hurt. She was able to get those students out of the bus. She was able to get them to a safe area. Neighbors began first aid, including an emergency room nurse. Odo County deputies, troopers, and volunteer rescue squads from Palmyra, Douglas, Syracuse, Nebraska City, and Lincoln responded. The fact that the right people were on the ground at the right time uh, also uh, is another ray of light, you know. Hart says another shining moment was how the students responded. We had kids that were hurt, obviously crying. Um, and in pain, uh, but we had we had kids that were there helping each other. All nine students and both drivers went to Brian West and Lincoln. The hospital says all but three patients are already home. Um, as you move forward, you're always looking for rays of light. You know, one of the rays of light was that uh, students were not more seriously injured. Near Palmyra, Andrew Ozaki, KETV, Newswatch 7.